Okay, so this is uh, Mitsubishi PLK uh, G2516. We're going to do some basic general instructions here. Uh, what we've got, we've got a special setting for the needle bar height, so you have to go through an extra step. But here's what happens when you first turn the machine on. Basically, it's going to check itself out here. It's going to load up the pattern on the screen. Okay, so this is the home button. So the first thing you gotta do is you gotta press the black pedal, make the clamp come down, and then you press the home home button, and the machine will home up. But you see, because we had that special needle bar setting, it's giving you this, this message. So you're gonna press this button here to make the needle bar position. Okay? And then it's in where it needs to be. And then it's gonna load the pattern up again, and then we're gonna press, press that. Normally we wouldn't have to do that if we didn't have the special needle bar setting. So now here we're gonna wind the bobbin. So if you see what we did, we press this button here, next, screen, and it gives us the bobbin. So that's the button here, we're gonna press that. So what you gotta do, you gotta, you gotta lower the clamp first. So you're gonna step on the pedal. And this function is really only if you have to wind the bobbin uh, independently of sewing the machine. Normally, if you're running the, a pattern, you can wind the bobbin simultaneously. And because this is like a nylon thread, what we did, he, he kind of made like a little loop around this bobbin so that it catches. And then when you step on the gray pedal, the machine's going to wind the bobbin. Now again, because this bobbin winder works off the, the machine turning, you can actually do this while it's sewing so that you never run out. Here it's going to wind the bobbin. When it finishes, it'll release itself. And that's it. You're done. Okay? And then the machine... So you actually have to hold your foot on the pedal to keep that running. Once you take your foot off the pedal, the machine will stop. And then at that point, you would just hit the X here and exit out of that screen, go back, and you can uh, run the machine now. While I'm at this stage here, this button here will lower the foot so you can thread the needle. So if I press this, it lowers it so you can thread the needle. This is the sewing speed, and this is if you want to jog the pattern around. All right, so that so we're gonna actually show in the next video the machine operating.